Hey guys, this is Captain Rex. I'm back to another video. In today's video, we are going to be building the candle shop, which is going to go right down here. And yeah, for now, that's going to be the last build from the town. So yeah, very exciting times. Uh, I have a bit of a cold, so if my voice kind of sounds weird, I mean, okay right now, but yeah, that's what's going on. Um, yeah, so lots of stuff from the newest video. Oh, I forgot to say we're joined by Avon. I don't know. Yeah, he's over there. Yeah, lots of stuff from the newest uh, video. Uh, like Ryan and Aiden have just been doing insane, crazy work. So I want to thank them for all their hard work. Yeah, they've just been finding all these little details. So first, we got a new addition to the Love Garden, and that is Cuddly Gorilla, and that is for in the farm factory. There is a broken melon, which needs to be right. It's right there. I don't know why that ladder says. It needs to be right there. I forgot to add it, but I, I know it's there. Uh, okay, over at the airport. That is where we're heading next. Okay, here's where you want the torches over here. They're going to look like that. And I guess I might as well just go ahead and remove this stuff as we go along here. And all the snow is melted that was over here. So you want to do that. Okay. At the farm factory, uh, sugar cane needs to be broken out right there. And then over in the farm here, the pumpkins, you want to look like this. And then here we go. Here's the big stuff. Yeah, more stuff at the mob trap. So yeah, emerald is grass, and then the, the redstone is removal block, and like, yeah, the kelp is fern. So I'm going to go over this stuff. Uh, there's some vine updates as well, and some bamboo. So yeah, here's this area, that's a double tall grass right there. And then some vine updates over in here, like that. And some more grass over here. Uh, some vines around here, grass there, and then grass and fern over here, there. You wanna remove a bamboo right there. And then here we go, there's some more over here. So that cobblestone that was here, that needs to be regular stone now. You wanna remove a bamboo there, that one's gonna be four high. And then uh, there's some vine and terrain changes over here. It's like these two blocks need to be broken out. And yeah, the vines are gonna look like this now. And these ones down here, like just come down like there, there, and there. They're up like that. There's some terrain changes here and you want, yeah, the gold is gonna be a dandelion. Yeah, so there we go. And then there's a bunch of grass there. Remove the shroom light that was there. Add it, all, all the signs just tell you what to do. Terrain change over here, move a shroom light there, and then there's a bunch of grass and flowers and stuff right here. And then for the bamboo, so these two are five blocks high. This one is six right there, and then this one is 16, which goes right there. And then we have a 14 right there, and then you skip a block and have a 12, and then right here we're gonna have a 12, 11, and 10, all beside each other right there. So I think that's it for the mob trap updates. I'm gonna show this over here now. There's a block broken out there for some reason now. I don't know why, but there is. Um, and then over here by the rocket, we got a torch. So you wanna line up right there, three blocks away. And then there's a torch right there. And then let's go to the museum where he has moved the dragon egg in here. Uh, so yeah, there was a dragon egg here, but now it's just a regular, uh, egg. Uh, so let's see. I don't even know if we'll get to the dungeon. There's like a lot of updates. Um, okay. To the storage room. Yep. Okay. So we got that there. Yeah. And okay. So storage room. Dude, the chests are actually pretty much the same from the last video. The only thing is you want to add and make this one a double chest right here. Uh, so let's remove that. And let's see. Okay, we got a couple things in the town from Moises. So they're, one of them is a bit of a bigger thing. So we had like this arrow of terracotta along the front here. That's actually not there. So you actually want just purple stained glass go let all in so we have the three arrows there but not there and let's see what else 
over at Fizzy Fun, we actually had the banner wrong. Uh, you want it to be look like this, and you want to have that. So there we go. Uh, that's that. And the last thing is the uh, grass along here. Yeah, Ryan went over. And there's a couple things that need to be changed. Yes, yeah, so redstone, you want to remove the grass. Then emerald is add one. And I'll just pan over all of this. You guys can take a look. And yeah, uh, just pause the video and see what you got to do. And there's a terrain change, I think, here. That needs to look like that. And yeah, there's another one here where, where you want to add another block. Now, I, I posted something in the community tab about the terrain along the golf course and kind of the creeper coast area if you want uh, me to do that. So yeah, so there's comment on that post. Uh, but we're going to be getting to this probably at least some of the terrain along here after the this one. Because yeah, we're going to be getting to the fun land. Okay, so I think we're about ready to start. We've got to make the long trek over. So he hasn't really showed this since the last uh, time or when he built it. So it kind of got a, I don't know, it, it might be updated at some point because he obviously has to put a sign on and stuff. Uh, so yeah, um, I forgot to mark where the path is going to go. That's all right. It's going to be right here, but I'll count over if you guys want. So one, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 blocks. And it's going to go in by 2 right there. And I quickly, before we continue, um, just so you guys want this extra detail, we can leave 2 blocks. There's a crafting table here and then 2 barrels like this. I think they're facing that way. Yeah. 2 barrels like that. Okay, so first, let's grab some white concrete because that is what the first candle is going to be. So they're all five by five. So what we're gonna do here, go out on each side, two, three, four, five. And then we're gonna build this five by five in there. And this is gonna be five blocks tall. So two, three, four, five. Yeah, so five blocks tall. And then the doorway is gonna be there with, yeah, a spruce door. So at the top, what it d does is just goes in a block and then we have like a three by three right there and then at the top we want to grab uh yeah we want to fill this in there's going to be two blocks of coal and then campfire is actually it needs to go that way just like that uh, okay so there we go that's the first one so we'll do the red one next um, so the red one, we're just going to go in two blocks and we're going to one, two, three, four, five, and then we'll do our five by five, five around like this. So that one's going to go up two more blocks than the last one. So it's going to be a total of seven. Yeah, just like this. Yeah, and then we're gonna do our little three by three at the top. And yeah, so there we go. And we're gonna get two, and then we're gonna kind of go over like this, like diagonally one right there. And campfire is gonna go that way right there. Okay, so let's do the purple one. Let's just grab the last two. They're purple and yellow. So purple over here in the back. So we're gonna start right here. Leave one right there. One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. And we'll uh, just make that a box. And this one is gonna go up um, four more than the white. So one, two, three, four. And we'll build that one up. And yeah, the yellow one, so it kind of skips two blocks and then we're gonna start there. And the yellow one is only actually four blocks tall. So that's what you want for that one. So I'll build up the purple one. Okay, while you build that one up, I'll just cap this off. So yeah, we want a three by three. And the wick on this one is really long. I don't know why, because Fizzy did it. It's one, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven. So uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Just like that. And then boom, there we go. Campfire is gonna go that way. And then on top of that one, yep, we're gonna have two. And then one back diagonal like that. And the campfire is gonna go that way. Thank you, Ryan, for reminding me. Do the campfires the right way. Uh, okay, so there's the outside done. Yeah, really, really simple. So going into the inside, uh, the first thing we're gonna do is the floor is all spruce planks. So yeah, uh, we also gotta break out the, uh, the gaps here. So back here, like it's gonna be broken out like that, leading into there and then into the next one we're gonna have uh i think it's these two right there and then that one's broken out um and then that wall here okay yeah we want it like that and then there's a doorway going there okay so let's break this all out so it's all uh spruce planks Uh, okay, so uh, let's start out here with the uh, the white room. So above the door, we're going to get ones like that and that. And then there's going to be like a spruce fence on each of these sides with a torch up like this. And then there's going to be a bunch of these barrels. Uh, if I place the barrels down... Do you want to fill them and then put the right candle on top? That would be, I guess, the best way of doing it. So we're going to get one there and there. One right there. And then we're going to get one, two. And there's going to be one right where you're standing. Right there. It, it's pretty cramped. I, I mean, it's, it's not the best design. And then back in the red area over here. One, two like that. One facing up. And then one, two like that. And then here on each side, there's going to be a torch. So they're going to just skip two. I think I only have some of the containments for some because just the ones that Stampy actually put in. So all of them might not have the containments, but I think most of them do. And then, okay, for this purple area, we're going to get one there, one there, facing up like that. And then one, two there. And then one right here. And then, yeah, we're just going to skip two right here and do our torch just like that okay so the yellow area okay going into here um, so the yellow area in the video he actually only placed two torches it's weird so there's there's one right here and then a torch on either side and then there's one right here. I, I feel like it's going to change, but if we're going for accuracy, that's what we're going to do. Um, and then we just want <clears throat> a birch stair and slab. So we've got a little like slab and then stair thing for the little counter here. And then let's see, we want a stone stair for the register. And then birch uh, thing like that. And we actually want it facing that way. So we're going to open it up like that. Okay, there we go. So yeah, really, really easy stuff. Um, so yeah, the roof does go all the way up on them. So let's go out to the uh, white area here. So this is, uh, I think it's okay. This is the magenta one. And yeah, we want eight candles in there. And then on top of this one, we're going to have three light blue. We don't really have uh, ones for that. Oh, this actually needs to be cyan. I mean, it's kind of hard to tell. I'll, do, I'll fix that. Three cyan right there. What? Do I have two cyan? Oh, there, I guess there just is two cyan. Okay, 10 of the regular uh, candles in there. And then over here, we want eight yellow, nine white. 
and then the red there's gonna be two like that we don't have the ones for that i think he did over here at the purple room okay we're gonna get two right there don't have that the blue one right here and it's gonna be three green and then two red two brown and then there's another three sign i i guess the helpers must have just messed that up or something because i'm pretty sure they did that and then over here we're gonna get uh nine lime eight pink um and then okay let's help fill this in okay we're gonna have light blue here we're gonna have 10 light blue let me just grab a stack one two three there we go ten and then we have black candles right here eight and then nine orange so there we go like i said really really simple easy build i just want to uh go through and make sure we got everything and we uh look to have it looks like okay yeah okay let's go down and uh do this uh dungeon area thing okay so we're gonna need to dig a hole and that hole is gonna go right here um yeah it's gonna go down right here and yeah this is gonna have to go down i think it's till y11 okay so it's gonna be okay we want to kind of fill this in with dirt here so there's gonna be three dirt below the path and then we're gonna have to replace the rest of this with stone one two three okay so going down from here it's stone so let's just dig down okay to there for now uh are you able to replace that with stone what needs to be stone underneath yeah exactly like that so if we go down this um it's quite a ways down I gotta figure out where the ladder, what side of the ladder's gotta go. So the ladder is facing towards the theater. Okay. So yeah, the ladder is gonna go right there. Yeah, on that side. I don't know if the best way to place this, it's gonna be really cramped going down here. Yeah, I'm not gonna build the whole cave system just the dungeon i feel like it's gonna be covered up anyway i don't know we'll see he didn't show it in this video i kind of wish he would have showed this in the make sure it's still here along with the candle shop that would have been nice okay so we're gonna have to go down to here i think it's y11 that's where I think it was. If I can actually uh, go all the way down. Um, let's see. Let's see what block it is. Okay, we wanna go down to Y10. Oh, I, I am at Y10, okay. So we're gonna start right here. So yeah, the ladder's gonna go down to there. And uh, the last two blocks actually of this ladder our dirt and then we have one two three cobblestone just like that okay let's see if we're at the right chords yes okay so uh the walls for this so the cobblestone is the walls of the dungeon so we want to go two to this side so two to the left and then we're gonna go four to the right. One, two, three, four. So uh, one, two, three, four. And then this way along here, we're gonna go three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, uh, so one, two, three. Yeah, let's just break out a bunch of this. It doesn't matter. One, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven. Okay, let's break this out here. Okay, seven right there. And then yeah, this wall is gonna be three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, perfect slash build. So one, or one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so let's fill in these walls here. We're gonna need to break some of the walls out, but yeah. So where we have the ladder going down, uh, over here, we're not gonna build this cave, but yeah, we're gonna break out these three and these two. That's gonna kind of lead into this whole cave system that we got going on. Um, so we got to dig down three blocks below these walls. Yeah, three blocks all the way around, which uh, Avon has just did. Um, okay, so let's add some of the details. So right here, we're going to get a two by two of dirt. Let's also dig down here. Um, and then, yeah, on the ceiling... I just want to see how I want to do this. Okay, so we have this area right here. Okay, down here, there's going to be two added cobblestone. That one's broken out. And then above here, actually, we're going to break out these. And then there's this two by three of gravel there like that. And there's, yeah, some of this coal and uh, redstone goes along the roof like that and there's one gold in the back um, if I can get my gold ore I think it's like back yeah opposite the ladder so back here we're gonna leave two we got that one right there and I don't know why this one's broken out that one needs to be like that okay so yeah kind of diagonal to this block there's a chest here that faces this way I think we do have the containments for that if you want to add that in even um, and then there's also another one in the back which we'll get to um, so there's this weird diagonal thing he's got going on here so yeah we're gonna start in this corner and kind of do break out just like two blocks going across here just like that and then um okay so we have that there's bits of cobblestone we can add in for extra detail so yeah like right here and there's gonna be a dirt right here like that and if we go down to this end on the third diagonal right there we're gonna get a cobblestone and then if we go down to this one right here and go one two three four a block broken out here with a ladder for some reason I didn't really watch the video he did this actually like Aiden built this on the realm um, and then okay so we're gonna go over to here and yeah we're gonna go out one two three from the I think it's three or is it two it's actually two from there and then we're gonna get cobblestone kind of going around each block here and yeah this is gonna be a zombie spawner so I don't even know if it'll let me place a spawner because probably I'm peaceful oh it is let me so let's get a zombie not just a regular zombie Torch. Let's place the torch on top first. There we go. Zombie is in the spawner. Um, no, chest looks exactly like that. It, it's because it's like a mixed up tat, or chest from a dungeon. That's why it's not all like in order. Uh, so we have that. There's the spawner. Uh, and then there's one more chest. If we go like two blocks back here, and that's going to go right there. Uh, I'll let you fill in that, and I'm going to place in the water. So water is going to go in the corners, so right there, and right over here, just like that. 
Yeah, it should flow perfectly. That yeah, that just lines up like that. Um, okay, so we actually got this dungeon done as well, which is really nice. Uh, I'm not really sure how many blocks down this exactly is because I just kind of built down to negative 10, but I guess do the math from 70 down to negative 10. Uh, maybe I'll try to count. Let's see. I, um, it's probably better to count from up or from the bottom, I mean. I don't know. Uh, I think, is that it for that chest? Yeah, the chest just needs to look like that. Okay. So, um, to the bottom of the ladder here, it is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight. 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59. I'm guessing, I mean, if it's down to negative 10, it's pro. yeah, I think that number is around right. Yeah, I, I forgot to say first, but if you guys are do, doing it to this level of accuracy, I would highly recommend having accurate coordinates. If you're really adding in this dungeon, getting like this little detail here. Yeah, so that's crazy. Town is done for now until they build something else. It, it's taken a really long time, but yeah, I'm excited to move on to the fun land. And yeah, so we're gonna be working on Funland terrain. We're gonna be starting up like kind of like the part thing, like the Funland, or we did for the town. It's gonna be like the terrain and path. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna be working on the terrain for the sign. That's gonna be first, and then yeah, and yeah, you guys respond to that community post about that terrain over there. Maybe we'll add that on, do some more of that with the sign. Anyways. Uh, thank you, Avon, for helping out today. And yeah, thank you guys all for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye, everybody.